welcome to this week's video. Now, if you're anything like me, this little object spends a lot of time in your hand. If that is the case, then today's video on text abbreviations is a must watch for you. And helping us with the video is my sister Tessa and her friend George, who are gonna to compete to tell you the full meaning of each text abbreviation. But just before we start the video proper, I'd just like to ask, if you're new to learning English with Cambridge, please subscribe to the channel, because subscribing will ensure that you get notified every time you release a new video, and ensures you won't miss out on a thing. So yeah, please subscribe, and yeah. Anyway, let's get cracking with the video. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna read out a text acronym, and when you know the answer, Tessa, I would like you to beep your horn, let's hear it. Thank you, okay, and George, I would like you to squeeze your chicken. <coughs> right, BRB. <coughs> George, be right back. BRB. You use this when you're going away for a short while, but with the intention of coming back. Speaking, lol. Quite obvious this one, you use it when you find something funny. B. By the way? Yes, George, BTW, by the way. <laughs> BTW. We use this when you're adding something or bringing something up that's off topic. I? I don't know. IDK, I don't know, thank you, okay. IDK. This is very obvious, you use this when you don't know something. Y-O-L-O. Y-O-L-O. Or when spoken, YOLO. You use this to express the idea that you should take risk and live life to the fullest. F O M O Fear of missing out. Yes, Tessa. F O M O Or when spoken, FOMO we use this to describe feeling apprehensive about the idea of missing out on something potentially cool or rewarding. So there you have it, six really useful text abbreviations for next time you're texting somebody in English. As ever, please don't forget to like and share this video as well as comment below with topics that you'd like to see covered in future videos. And of course, as mentioned before, please don't forget to subscribe. As always, thanks for stopping by. We really appreciate your continued support and I will see you next time for more language fun.